friends, welcome back to another Extreme Clean with me. Today I'm going to be mopping my house for the first time in way too long. We broke our mop a while back and I never replaced it and recently in a cleaning video I had asked all of you which mop was your favorite and you all answered almost unanimously that I should get the O Cedar mop. And then I'm gonna be cleaning with this lavender eucalyptus Clorox just because it's been such a long time since I mopped my floors. I know it's disgusting, but I wanted to make sure and get them really clean and really disinfected. So that's why I chose that cleaning product as opposed to something more mild or non-toxic. So now I'm just gonna be going through my downstairs area and mopping really, 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 really thoroughly all of the floors downstairs. wanted to invite you if you haven't yet subscribed to my youtube channel don't forget to do that before leaving today i would love to have you as a subscriber and i love having kind of this community that we have mostly women who can kind of share tips and tricks down in the comments and everybody is seriously so sweet to me and to each other down in the comments i just love that so let me know down in the comments say hey i'm a new subscriber and even if you are a subscriber that you've been here for a long time i'd love to hear from you down in the comments as well it's funny because i have watched youtube for so many years and it took me probably five years to start commenting on youtubers videos and it's so funny because i just never really thought to do it but once i started doing it i was like oh my gosh i actually get to know this person so don't forget leave me a comment say hey say what's up air hug you know all that good stuff mention if you can see these bins over here on the right side of the screen if you haven't yet watched my bathroom dollar tree organization video i'll make sure and leave it linked down below in the description box or up here in the icard and it's i think a really great video just because i love organizing and i love organizing especially with dollar tree products because it's so cheap and i get a bunch of those labels from amazon and all that stuff so i have all the information in that video on how i organize my family of five to live in a very small condo here in los angeles california so if you're interested in seeing me organize my bathroom i'll make sure and leave that video linked below so 
after I was done with all the mopping, I decided it was time for a lunch break. So I pulled out some Ling Ling pot stickers and egg rolls and I partnered up with Ling Ling and they are sponsoring this portion of the video. So I was so excited when they reached out to me because growing up, my mom used to buy these pot stickers for us and we would always get them from Costco. It was just a fun way to switch up the food that we had in our house. Ling Ling has really authentic flavored recipes and I've always loved their pot stickers. They only use high quality ingredients with fresh vegetables and proteins. Making these pot stickers was super easy and I cannot wait to make them for Sean. I already told him that I will have to make like a little date night after the kids go to bed with pot stickers and a game or something like that. Definitely perfect for families who want to kind of switch things up a little bit. And then they come with a signature dipping sauce and it was good enough I could have drank it and I might have drank it a little bit. I'm not gonna lie. So I'm so glad I only made half of the package because otherwise I would have eaten the entire bag myself. They taste so delicious. So if you want to try some of these out for your family, check out my description box for a link. So after I finished eating my lunch, I'm just going to get my all-purpose spray and start spraying down my counters and just kind of get things cleaned up and crumbs cleaned up and all that kind of good stuff. You can see that I'm talking to my kids. Yes, my kids were home with me while I was filming this video. So there were a lot of interruptions that I edited out. There's so much going on with YouTube right now and you know, this mom community and any channels that feature their kids or stuff like that. So just until things kind of calm down or until I figure out exactly what is going on, I'm definitely gonna be focusing a lot more on my channel with cleaning videos and things that don't really include my kids quite as much. I'd rather be safe than sorry and I really don't wanna get my YouTube channel shut down. So I'm just gonna kind of gear my channel a little bit more towards cleaning than I have in the past. And then another thing that is kind of an update here on my channel is I have started an uploading schedule. So because I had Hudson, I have a son, he's 10 months old in case you're new here. Once I had Hudson, I decided to kind of go off of my uploading schedule and just do it whenever I possibly could. But now I've been uploading every Wednesday and Sunday in the mornings. I hope you guys have been liking that schedule. Let me know down in the comments what you think about it. But just so you know, you can remember that I always will upload new videos on Wednesday and Sunday.
So once I was done cleaning up the kitchen, I moved into the dining room area and just started clearing off our table. Our table is so tiny. We are so growing out of this thing, but you know what? It works for us for what we need, but it does get very cluttered very quickly. So when the kids get home from school, it's like all the lunch boxes and backpacks and water bottles and everything are on there. So I always try to just get everything taken care of, everything signed, all the homework stuff figured out, all of the lunch boxes cleaned out and put away and packed for the next day. And yeah, that way I feel like, okay, we can actually eat dinner on this table tonight. <laughs> Now that I got that table totally wiped down and cleared off, I'm just gonna go ahead and start vacuuming up my carpet. You can see Hudson hanging out with me right there in his high chair. He is again 10 months old and he's definitely in the stage where he is like a human vacuum cleaner. He just crawls around and puts every single little tiny thing in his mouth, which is sometimes very dangerous. So I have been really trying to be diligent about vacuuming my carpets because if I don't, he will find any little tiny specks of anything and eat them. So yeah, that's kind of a new fun stage we're going through right now. Also, if you are in the market for a new vacuum cleaner, this vacuum cleaner is the bomb.com. I always talk about it, so I'm sorry if you've been around for a while and you're like, hello, stop saying that your Shark Rocket vacuum is awesome, but it is awesome. So if you're looking for a new one, I'll make sure and have it linked in the description below. And then if you haven't yet seen my morning routine, I'm gonna go ahead and link that here at the end. And then I'm also gonna link my Dollar Tree bathroom organization video with the Dollar Tree products, and I'll have that linked here at the end also. And then if you do wanna subscribe, all you have to do is click the little circle that has my face on it here, and you will be subscribed to my channel. Don't forget to put the bell notifications on. Thank you so much for hanging out with me for another video. I absolutely love having you here. I hope that you enjoy it as well. Those vacuum lines are on fleek. Is that even a correct statement? I don't know. And lastly, don't forget to check out Ling Ling in the description box below to get you some delicious pot stickers. <laughs>